It's interesting that Darden is back. North Texas brought the house last punt. It's a high short punt. And it takes an absolutely perfect UTSA bounce. Yanni Roots is doing his job. You know, the last punt that he had careened into the end zone, and I know he wasn't real thrilled about that, but boy, you couldn't have asked for a better punt. Well, all right, Mason, fine. All you have to do is go 98 yards down the field <laughs> to win this game. No timeouts, 98 yards. Your team trails by four. Let's see if Mason Fine has anything left or if Jalen Guyton has any more magic left well, and that's in the this thing. game. You, you've got to still, I think you've got to bring some pressure because if you give Mason Fine time to throw, you're also giving Guyton time to run, and that's what would concern me the most. Here comes some pressure. Fine over the middle. And Michael Lawrence is dragged down at a short game. UTSA just slacking off. They're going to give him that, especially with no timeouts and the clock still ticking. No first down there. Well, I like that they were still bringing some heat. Here comes Tawa Effa. Fine to the sidelines. Rico Bussey Jr. with a reception. That stops the clock. And now North Texas has moved out of the shadow of its own end zone. UTSA will take that all day long. Keep everything in front of you and get some pressure on the quarterback and do not let number nine beat you deep. Yeah, still 80 yards to go for North Texas, trailing by four. Fine has to escape. He's going to throw it long down the sidelines and too high, out of bounds. That's the second time Rico Bussey Jr. has made a catch and a very good one only to be out of bounds and have it brought back. Well, again, UTSA doing a lot of different things schematically and giving Mason Fine a lot to look at. They looked like they were going to bring the pressure again that side and then drop very deep into coverage. So they're giving him some different looks right here, trying to junk it up and make it as, most, as difficult as possible for him as he tries to navigate this offense down the field with only 41 ticks left. Jalen Guyton is at the top of the screen. He's been a menace all day for the UTSA defense. Fine, going to chuck it downfield. And it's caught. Caught by Lawrence. Austin Jupe had it. He did everything right, but time has jumped. He saw it. He tracked the ball. He just left his feet too soon. Clock stops, 32 seconds left, ball on the 31 for North Texas. Trying to pull off perhaps the biggest win in the young Seth Luttrell era. And a timeout by UTSA. They kind of calm everyone down over there. Well, that now you got to change your defense too. Now the goal is still the same. You got to keep them out of the end zone. But look, Austin Jupe is right there. He just. Left his feet a switch too soon. Was it a little push? Kind of looks like there might have been a little sly receiver move those good receivers do, but you're right, Absolutely. the timing for Jupe just underneath that ball. Yeah, that's what the best receivers do. They find a way to get some separation, and they do it any way they can. Now, this matchup's lived up to everything we expected. Absolutely, and then so. Said something about last team having the ball might win this thing, but both of these defenses have played reasonably well too, considering the skill level that they're facing from the opposing offense. North Texas needed a game-winning field goal on September 23rd here against UAB. That was their last home game. And they conjure up some more magic. Fine downfield. Hauled in, but short of the first down marker, so the clock's still going. And now it's under 20 seconds left. Fine spikes it. And I'm not sure if North Texas knew right away that they didn't get the first down, but then they scrambled to the line of scrimmage to spike that ball. Now 17 seconds left and third down. Trailing by four. <laughs> Man, this has been some kind of game. Win, lose, or draw. We know we're not going to see a draw with a four-point difference on the scoreboard, though. 
Here comes pressure. Fine got hit, throws it in, it's caught. Bussey Jr. has space to the 10 yard line and he's gonna take it into the end zone. North Texas scores with 10 seconds left to take the lead. Amazing. But Mason Fine is in a lot of pain. He might have just sacrificed his body for the biggest win in Seth Luttrell's young tenure. C.J. Levine got a wicked shot on him, and then once the ball got free and the receiver was running clean, you knew it was going to be awfully hard for UTSA to make this stop. One crack right there. Devron Davis can't make it happen. And here's the shot from C.J. Levine. Just a smidge too late, and just a player making a play by Mason Fine. Unbelievable football game. 